Hello everyone and welcome to another Minecraft episode. I am Happy Little Introvert and it's very nice to see everyone again. So we're going to get right into this episode of my Let's Play series. The first one I started. Um, I have in my inventory a lot of this dark old oak logs and I think I'm going to use the slabs and the fence and I'm going to put them all together. Just for now. Um, just the dark oak stuff. Because we really, really need a little room for all of this. And as you can see here, I've got oak, birch, and jungle wood right here. Just making a little spot for this in my little room. Expanding it a tiny little bit. So, because I really have no idea how big this should be or anything. I mean, I like how wide this is um but i don't know i've got to do something about the torches i know that i can hang lanterns once had a little glitch there once the um the 1.14 update comes out and we're gonna do that now, if you hear me sipping on something, it's uh, coffee, because I'm recording this in the morning, so I can get it out to you guys by this afternoon. And, uh, yep, my coffee is very, very tasty. Um, it's uh, pumpkin spice. I know pumpkin spice in December, right? I've also got peppermint. I've got a wide variety of creamers right now because I my mother bought some and she bought some I didn't want and I decided to drink it but then I told her what I did want I went and I bought it instead I didn't think she was gonna buy it for me and she bought it so now I've got lots and lots of coffee creamer because my mother always does little errands for me and occasionally comes to visit. I am having some type of lag in this world as if it is the actual 1.14. I know it's not. It's still the 1.13.2. The latest release they have out there. I didn't want to go too far. <clears throat> just in case redstone nothing to get the redstone with great probably not one pick in here i have 39 levels Ooh. fortune three and mandy perfect i did have one in here awesome i gotta make a tool room or maybe a tool house That's, that's all I had, really? That was it. Well, um, we got plenty of wood. I'm going to make a double chest. Unless I've got a double chest in here. Yeah, I got plenty of chests. I don't need to make one. I've even got one piece of glowstone. And one of these. And I've got five of these. I don't know if it's going to be enough. Let's go ahead and see if this is going to be enough. Fabulous. That was just the perfect amount. And there should be a chest here and something here. But for now, we got to put... Okay, and we're going to store our dark oak. Actually, I want one piece. And <clears throat> if you guys hear that in the background, I don't know if you can. Uh, I guess I didn't turn my phone off. And I'm hearing a cat meow in the background because that's what my phone does. It's kind of loud. Oh, I forgot to stick the uh, saplings in here. 
Now, do I have jungle saplings? No, I have no jungle sapling. What about birch? Yep, I've got... What the heck? Combine those. Okay, that looks to be fine. And... Okay, so we've got that. We've got this. This needs a torch. And... Perfect. Um, I'll go ahead and put some chests here, and I'll fill that up, even though there's not going to be anything down there. Where, where am I going? Here. That's fine. That'll be fine for later. I'm always expanding my treasure room. Alrighty, and then one more set of chests. We'll put this back because we're not using it. Same with the redstone. Now I wanna get back today. Why do I have this in here? We gotta, we gotta start ourselves another chicken farm. Um, my chickens got too far out of head, so out of hand. So I had to go ahead and do a chicken killing spree. Um, I'm thinking about. I don't want to do an automatic chicken cooker, but I'm thinking about doing the same thing I did to the pigs and the cows, and maybe placing them down there. Hopefully, they won't be able to jump out. I don't know. They might be able to. little bit too much cobble there so we've got tons and tons of picks I made tons because we are going to um, take the mountain down the side of the mountain down just a tiny tiny bit so that is my next project is to take that mountain down and I'll have tons of stone. So I gotta get rid of what stone I have. Let me go down here. I think this first room is our dirt room, and then down here is the stone room. I should actually label it. So I'll organize my chests. I'm so unorganized. I like to keep a room full of dirt just in case I need some for later. Like uh, this room. We definitely need dirt. Why does it look so dark? Okay, it's got the glowstone in there. I don't know why. Maybe when lanterns come out, we can put some lanterns in here. Oh, close the door. Don't want the creepers getting in there. Redstone. Um... Yay. Okay. I'm excited. And I don't have anything to fill the hole with. Well, guys, I'm going to get to that mountain and I'll get right back with you. See you in a bit. Okay, guys, I am back and this is what I am talking about. All of that. See how all of that is flat? Well, I would like all of this flat as well because I would like to flatten it down and maybe put a house or two down here. I think that would be a fabulous idea. So, my beautiful little fenced-in village. I love this fence. So unique. So, we're going to go ahead. I've, as you can see, I already started a little bit. So, we're pulling it back to about here. And we're bringing it down. I think it'll be good. We'll see if I can pull it down any further. Make the uh, mountain just a little smaller. So, goodness. <sighs> Broke my pickaxe already. Good thing I have a couple. I don't want to use any of my other things because, you know, I make iron golems with them or I could make um, iron pickaxes. Although so far I've only had to make one iron golem. I might make one for this town. 
Um, they're useful for cauldrons and they're going to be useful for the lanterns. Because as you know, it, all, it takes, um, I believe, nine iron ingots from one iron bar to make the lantern with a torch inside. So when I get down and I have made some progress, I'll show you guys what I've done. But I don't think you guys are going to want to watch me dig the whole time. Although it is pretty relaxing. <laughs> So, um, see you guys in a bit. Alright guys, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm back with you and that's what I've done. I've cleared off that much, so I now have that much land. My next plan of action, tear this house down. I'm going to tear this house down and I'm going to build one over here. That way we can take, start taking all of this down to match all of this down here. And let me see, I could probably put two more houses down there. Three, two, three more. Uh, eventually. So, but this, what I'll do, hmm. I'll tear down this house. And then I'll tear down that house over there. So we'll start with this one. I tell you, I love this efficiency axe it's awesome it, it cuts down wood so quickly it's like I've got the enchanted sharp bladed axe I don't know it seems like the other ones are really dull and it takes forever So, hmm, got to take that thing down too. Um, maybe I'll go ahead and I'll just take two of these houses down and rebuild them exactly, well, not exactly as is, but you know, pretty much the same, except for the furniture. I could care less if it has got furniture, just as long as it can house the villagers. Until I can get the whole entire village completely flattened down. Got everything here? This is when I, uh, wish I had made myself a shovel but this part is the boring part of course I just have to show you the work that I am doing and I'll go ahead and tear this one down oh no lost my pick I've got another one yeah having another pick is always awesome The sun is setting once more. Now, I haven't had too much trouble with, um, like, uh, creepers and zombies in the village. I had one creeper one time that scared the heck out of me and made me jump. I had caught that on film. But other than that... Um, let me see, there were two zombies just last night. You know what, I'm thinking about going to the Christmas tree and putting some glass like that. I think that would be awesome. Oh, what am I doing? It's wood. The villagers never use these houses anyway. They mainly use those two houses over there. Whoa. He ran super fast. 
Well, I think the only reason I'm going to have to go in at night is if the phantom starts coming after me. But I don't want to bore you guys to death with the tearing down of two buildings. So I'll get back to you when I start building them and when I decide where to build them. Okay, and we're back. Some of these episodes are going to be kind of boring because they are going to be just building and most likely replicating um, what has already, oh goodness, um, been built up there just for the villages. I'm not even going to build, every, build, built, build every single, um, I made this a little smaller, didn't I? Oh well, the other one will be bigger. Um, we are going, not even going to build everything. Um, yeah, let's, let's take this down. Bring it out one more. I feel kind of too cramped in there. Horrible for someone who has claustrophobia. Especially because I'm not leaving any windows in here. Oop, went too high. But these are just temporary shacks. So they can live in. And one episode, I just gotta go and get tons and tons of um, spruce wood, I believe. Yes, yeah, spruce. Okay, now, how is it? Okay, perfect. I like that. And get a door in here, it's just fine. They can come in here and get shelter. So we got that, just plain, very, very plain. And we tore down the other one, so we're gonna make it. As I said, these aren't gonna be anything special at all. And they can be rebuilt fairly quickly. So sorry, I'm not talking too much. I'm concentrating on the build. You know what? I might put a window in here. I, I'm just cheap on glass and time and resources. I mean, I have another Let's Play and I have some videos that I have out there. So, <clears throat> yeah, time and resources are a thing. If I had a little help here and there, it'd be fabulous. You know what? That's going to stay a window. That's going to stay a window. And that is now an official window. And they should be protected fairly well. If the villagers ever use these. Wow. I didn't realize I was taking so much damage from the falls. Kind of hungry. Okay, now let's go do the same thing in here. Let a little light in every now and then. And since I really don't want to just open up to anything and I'm too lazy to get glass, it's called laziness. We're going to go ahead and do this. I have used, in fact, I've used fencing on a lot of my builds for glass. And, and for glass instead of glass. 
mixing up my words here. It's uh, more medieval-like and a little bit more convenient. Especially when you're starting out a starter house and you can't smelt any glass. Perfect. Now all I need to do is make sure nothing spawns inside the house. And I think I'm good for this episode. Oh, yeah, roof. That would help, wouldn't it? Perfect. Don't want anything spawning around it. Or on top of it. So I'm going to put these on top. They don't need to be on the very top. Okay. There we go. That's perfect. Two houses and a lot more room. We're going to have to set the houses here on the edge like this because you know what I notice? Those oak doors make the houses look a little wider than the spruce. I guess it's because it's a lighter color. But anyway, yeah, this whole area is going to be filled with a gigantic house. <clears throat> And I want to do it that color, actually. Not the, no, not exactly that color. I think the spruce color, stripped wood. I'm going to need tons of it. But I've got to get a good portion done. I want all the villagers to live in that one singular house. And I would love to take that mountain down. Well, guys, until next episode, I will see you later. Go ahead and hit that notification bell if you haven't already to be notified of each and every episode as they come out. And hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Also, if you like my videos and you like my building and tearing down stuff, hit that subscribe button for me. Subscribe button, the like button, and the notification bell. Yay! I would love it if you would do that. It would really, really make me so excited. Well... See you later, guys. Bye.